everybody, this is the figure back again, and today I'm playing the Stanley Parable. Now, I played the original uh, mod, the mod one for Half-Life 2, and that was a hell of a lot of fun. And this is the full-fledged game version, so, you know, why not <laughs> give it a go? Um, I have played it before, but not much, really. Um, I I launched it and I walked for a few bit, but I'm here, so I'm just gonna begin the game. I don't think there's any way of saving. Never was it. There never was in the uh, in the original. The end is never. The end is never. The end is never. The end is loading. Oh, fantastic! Huh? The end is loading. <laughs> okay. So I'll just wait for this son of a bitch to load up and uh, see what happens. I mean, I loved this game. The mod was just fantastic. I mean, <laughs> holy hell, I loved it. Everything about it. I mean, it was just so absurd. <laughs> like, everything about it was so completely and utterly absurd. It was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Alright, <sighs> so I, I can't wait to see what they've done. With, with this. I really can't. <coughs> Pardon me. This is the story of a man named Stanley. I'll let you guys watch this. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. <coughs> employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor at his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day, of every month, of every year. And although others might have considered it soul ending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. Okay. Cool. Now this game. And then one oh, sorry. Day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him. How strange! No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. Oh. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he oh, got okay. up from his desk and stepped out of now, his Now I'm going to tell you now that everything you do in this game is narrated. You can do some weird as shit in this game. Like, there are so many different paths you can take. And I'm just talking about the modded version. I don't know how many paths there are in this one. But in the modded All version. All his co workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memory. Now, if you, you can follow what the narrator says and basically complete this game, <coughs> or you can do other random things. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. See what I mean? Like, he narrates everything, and it's brilliant. I love it. It's such an, uh, a unique game. I just turned off that computer. You know, save power for the company. Save power for the company. <laughs> now, there's no jump mechanic. There's a crouch mechanic, but for some reason, there's no jump. I've never been able to figure that one out. <laughs> that door's locked. Okay, how about this door? That door is also locked. <laughs> how about this painting? No. These pieces of paper? No. <laughs> And this game honestly has infinite replayability. I mean, the modded version literally had infinite replayability. Turn off that computer, save some more power. Like, because there was so much stuff that you could do. There's so much stuff that you couldn't do. You could only do in a, if you did a certain number of things. If you clicked these doors in the right order, you would get something else to do. And it would be like, oh, I'm sitting on a desk. <laughs> so yeah, it was like, it, the mod was brilliantly, fucking brilliantly interesting. There's so much stuff you could do. <laughs> I'm really hoping this is sort of the same. Ooh. Oh dear, someone spilt their coffee. It's gonna cost some uh, dry cleaning bill or laundry bills there. All these doors are locked. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door. <laughs> See, now, this is the same type of thing that was in the demo. Sorry, not the demo, the mod. You can either go through the left, 
go through the right, stay here, whatever you do, the narrator's going to narrate it. So if you want to do, as I said, complete the story, you can go through the left. Well, I feel like going through the right, because I don't want to complete the story. I already know this the story, I did it in the mod, uh, but I want to show what else is going perfectly got. well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Maybe I did! How would you know? I want to shut off that computer. Ah! I can't, I can't bash down doors, I got no... Apparently I'm just a floating head, don't even have feet. Well, that looks like a nice office. I want to go in there. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Ah, yes. Truly a Ooh, room worth admiring. Head. It had really been worth the detour after all, just <coughs> to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. I'll drink some coffee if you don't mind. Can I, like, do anything? Is there anything in here I can do? Yes. It's really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really worth it. As I said, the, the narrator in this game, like, the way they thought of everything that you do is absolutely brilliant. At this point, Stanley's obsession See? with this room bordered on creepy and reflected poorly on his overall personality. <laughs> it's possible that this is why everyone left. Seems highly unlikely. You said that people liked Stanley before. <laughs> oh, what's behind it? Oh, what's no Stanley sat around waiting for more dialogue, <laughs> but when a long time had passed and there was no more, he decided that the game was trying to send him a message. And you can also tell that the narrator breaks the fourth wall. And he does it quite a lot, actually. Fine, I'll move on. You don't want to see but me. But at last, he'd had enough of the amazing room, and took the first open door on his left to get back to business. And do I want to go through the first open door on the left? Really? Do I? I mean, it's an interesting door. Stuff in it. Or I could go this way to the loading dock. Loading dock. Left. Right. I'm going to leave this up to chance. I got a wallet. Yes, my Aperture Science wallet. <laughs> this side lands up. I go the proper way. This side lands up. I go to the loading dock. And go. Going the right way. Let's go. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. But I can go down a lift. <laughs> More chance. Proper way? Not proper way. Not proper way. Cool, going down the lift. I'm going down the lift, son of a bitch. Yeah! I'm not following your directions today! Loading, 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 oh, that's different, it doesn't say that last time. <coughs> Where am I going? But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about, and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, uh, from here, it's, um, left. Well, I want to go left. Can I go anywhere but left? No, apparently I can't. I have to go left. Oh, no. No, it's to the right, my mistake. Oh, thank you. Mr. Narrator, you're paying. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have <laughs> ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? Oh, brilliant. It's clearly... Oh, dear, would you hold on for a minute? Oh, yes, I'm... All the time in the world, my dear fellow. All the time in the world. Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right... Yep, yep, okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. It seems unlikely it's a garage. Okay. The story is this way. Can't go any other way, so I might as well head this way. Woo! No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. Shut. Okay, ah, kidding. Okay, okay, okay. We just, we just have to get back to, um... Oh, oh someone got fired. Who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. 
How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from no. the beginning. I want... And this time, I suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay. From the top. Really? Yay! I'm back at the beginning. Well, that seems like an appropriate stopping point. For Actually, no, fuck it. I'm going to go through this one more time. I'm going to do some other stuff. And then I'll All stop. All of his co gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a man. Now, I know that all, none of these doors open. I've tried them already. Unless they've changed. Well, that one's not open. So, oh my god, I'm getting myself turned around. When Stanley... Wait, Why are there so many wait, doors? What? No, I... No, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted I'm the game over completely recording. fresh. Everything should be... Oh, this <laughs> one changed. Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move the story I didn't somewhere? Do anything. Or, uh, hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. <laughs> it was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. All the time in the world, okay, my dear fellow. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Oh, which way do I want to go? I've got so many choices now. So many choices. Which way do I want to go? Well, those lead to the same place. Do these lead to the same place? Those lead to the same place, and I would assume that those don't lead to the same place. Let's go this way. Oh, my days. This is like a whole new... Ooh. Ooh. Wait, I, wait, what? Wait, what? Wait. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Do we just... Do we need to restart the game again? Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. Oh, hello. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it no, a... No, I was getting now. somewhere. God damn it, narrator. <laughs> right. I'm going to do this one more time. If I get to a room with only has two doors, two doors, then obviously it's restarted properly. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed the memo. Or perhaps I hadn't. I want to get on one of these tables. Well, there's that computer that's on again. How do I get onto, like... I can't, it's not even set. One. Jump, you son of an ass. Oh, hello, I did it. Yeah, I'm on top of the table. Right. Okay, so I'm up here. Now what? Go up. Okay, hold. I got on top of something. I don't know what. But Okay, I'm on the table. I might my, my goal here is to try and get out the window, simply because I think it would be fun. But I don't I've forgotten how to do it. I just Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Yes! Let's go. Out the window. Out the window. Can I get out the window? Get out of the window. Do it, Stanley. Do it for your family. Escape this horrid hellhole. Get out the window! Just get out the bloody window! No, oh, fuck. Well, apparently I can't get out the window. That's fine. I'll uh, go past all these. Let's try this. Ah, oh, I thought there was a door over there that I could get to. No. Oh well. Let's keep going. Keep going. And it okay. Yep, it's worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Sure thing, boss! Don't think we did, but okay. Sure, I'll head back. I'll check all these doors for you as well if you want. All my days. Okay, none of those doors open. That door doesn't open. Aha! I knew we'd miss something. Oh, well, bloody it! This wasn't here before! Here it comes. Okay. 
I'm just walking in circles, you... No, wait. Never mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back oh. to and retrace our steps. Really? Really? What the bloody hell? Where the bloody hell am I going? Ooh. Ooh, this is... Now this... Well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? Ooh. I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It... Is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? No. Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Yay! Congratulations! I know you put in a lot of hard work, and it really paid off, so good Thank you job. very much, thank you very much. I try. I try my best. Oh, no. No. I don't ah. about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any so did, actual I walked work around. for that win. Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Where the hell's the door? Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time, I have to restart. No! I was enjoying that. I really don't want to end this video, because... <laughs> Alright, I've got a solution. <laughs> this time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. <laughs> Just follow the line. How simple is that? Oh, I love the way there is infinite possibilities in this game. This has so much replayability because you could go do all the same steps to get here and then take a different tangent at each stage. It's brilliant. I love it so much. Let's turn off this computer again. Oh, I love it. You know what? I'm going to follow the line. Why not? I'll follow the line. But it doesn't seem right. I didn't. What? Oh. I wanted to go to this door the whole time, so why not? Cheeky son of a bitch is playing solitaire. Let me go shut off his teeth. I want to shut it off. Ugh. Okay. Is this the right way? I know this isn't the right way. I've completed the uh, completed the sto proper storyline before, but this is death. You see, the line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. It seems highly... Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey Getting such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? The okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. See, now we can both agree that the nature of existence is in fact a byproduct of one's subjective experience of that existence, right? Okay. Now, if my experience of your line? existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was Neither do I, but it was that. interesting. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Cool music. Which way do I go? The line or that way? I, I want to go that way, but I want to see where the line goes. Line? Not line. Helpful, I knocked my webcam off. I'm jealous of my clipping and I knocked my webcam off and lost my wallet at the same time. Stay there. Stay. Stay. Thank you. I don't even know what side it landed on. I don't even know what side it landed on. I'm gonna do this again. Fine. I really like this music actually. I don't think I can walk on the wall. Can I walk on the wall? I don't think I can walk on the wall. Okay. I said I follow the line and I'm following the line. This is absolutely nuts. I can't follow it like that. Yeah, that is exactly how I feel. Question marks. A giant. That was so pointless. 
I can't go up the wall. This game's so strange. 006. Where's 007? Did I miss it? James, open up, my like, son of a bitch. There's never a very good co worker, James. What in the name of the fuck is going on in this game? gonna go way over time. I do not care. This is ripping me out so badly. I probably could skip. What? 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 Peer reviews? Walk in a giant circle! Hey! Departmental account. Departmental account. Well, that's some inception like shit right there. Oh, no. Okay. I'm still following this line, I don't know. Cut the music. Go back and look at that fern. Okay. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Will it? Make sure you study it closely. And remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. It's a fern. Okay. It's a fern. I don't know how important it could be. And Wait, what? We're back at the office? No. <laughs> no. No. Line, you do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a well, bell? Well, following the line. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 not again. <laughs> Line, how could you have done this to us? And after we trusted you, after everything we've been through, bitch. you... Well, I can't take this anymore, to hell with it. Restart. Again. Literally, I could play this for hours and you're going to get a different story each time. Um, I'm going to cut it here. Uh, I will continue this, but it's going to be uh, part two. Two. <laughs> But this, this right here is going to be cut. So thank you for watching part one of the Stanley Parable. I hope you've enjoyed it so far. Uh, I know I am. Sure as hell I am. Anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, if you don't like what I'm doing, give me a comment in the, you know, leave a comment. Tell me what I could be doing better. If you have any games you want me to play, leave them in the comments. Send me a PM, either one. I don't mind and I'll tr get to it as soon as I can. Thank you for watching. Uh, knock my webcam off again. God damn it, I am so good at this. Right, before I record another video, I'm getting a brand new webcam clip. Because this is getting ridiculous. It's literally balancing on a very small piece of plastic. Okay? But anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this so far. I know I am. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!